Yo, yo, what's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the JR Fizzy channel. Welcome back to another EAFC 24 stream. Let's zoom in just a little bit. There we go. That is much better. You can actually see my face. I've got my um, dressing gown on, robe on, whatever the hell you want to say. It's cold, man. It is cold outside right now. It's raining a lot. I don't know why. It's a storm. Like, what is going on? Why is the weather like this? We didn't sign up for this. Britain, but yeah, hopefully everyone is good. Dear like how are we doing? Ads welcoming. It's Leah Williamson Day, the Arsenal captain, women's captain, should I say? Big up! What a time to be alive. Right, we've got 83 times 20, 100, 100 players pack, and a small prime goal players pack. Right now, obviously we're gonna go into a game first. The one thing I actually need to do is before, yeah, let me get this out of the way because I didn't actually uh, complete this yesterday. I haven't opened FIFA all day. That's crazy. But yeah, literally today, what we're going to do is we're going to go into one game, kind of finish off qualities and stuff like that. And then what we're also going to do is after, we're going to see if we can grind out that second hero player pick. Now, I shouldn't be doing it, but I'm a D-Gen and I'm not here tomorrow as well. So we got to do something today. Do you know what I mean? Because I'm not here tomorrow because unfortunately, as I say, uh, we have got a few things to sort out at the house. So I won't be live tomorrow. Uh, we'll be live back on Monday after the bank holiday weekend. Um, so, yeah. With that being said, though. Um, yeah, with that being said, we'll slap that in. Get an 84 times 5. That will obviously refresh in a in a, in a a jiffy. Um, the worst thing is, I didn't even do my daily gold and silver upgrades. That is crazy. It's actually crazy, but it's fine. They'll refresh again. We get more cards. It's all good, man. We do need to go. Oh! Rival rewards. I completely forgot about rival rewards. So we actually got rival rewards today as well. So these are the new rival rewards. Uh, so we got two. We got four eighty-five pluses. I literally forgot about these. Meaning, yeah, we're a hundred percent gonna get this hero pick done today. One hundred percent, we're actually gonna get the hero pick done today. Oh, we will be there. Oh, we will so be there. Now this is all tradable stuff, isn't it? Now, I want the most packs. So, two Jumbo 415Ks. Yeah, I want this one, number two. Oh, we will be there. Rain beat the crap out of me today, man. Yeah, it's honestly... I don't really get it. I don't really get it. It's been crazy. Like, it's been so bad. Um, So, yeah, it's been it's been horrible, man, to be completely honest. Like, it's genuinely been horrible. Um, All right, let's go into Champs Qualies, man. We're 4-0 right now. We're doing bits right now. I don't know why, or I don't know how. Because uh, I don't like this game. I don't like the way it plays. I don't like anything about it. But somehow, we're doing okay. We are doing okay. And we go from there. We go from there. We're going to try Rolfo at left wing. Sour back at Cam. Uh, we're going to put him into a 4-2-3-1. And see what we can do, man. See what we can do. But hopefully you guys are good. Big up to everyone always coming through. As always, big up Twitch and Facebook as well for coming through and hanging out as well. I know you guys are always here. Especially there's one viewer in Twitch. You're a legend because you're always here. I don't know if it's the same person every day, but big up you, man. Thank you so much for that. What a guy. Or girl. Or dog or cat. I don't know. But yeah. Big up. Right. For some reason, I can't find a game. Is this normal? Okay, now we found a game. Love it. Right. FC 24. What are we saying? What you got for me today? I am 4-0, so I'm expecting probably a hard game. I need sleep. Yeah, same. That's his team name. Yakin, Carvalho and Tadebo. Makale. Wow, okay. Jude Fernandez and Mia Ham. That is so sweaty, man. I don't come up against Jude a lot. And I don't come up I, I don't come up against Mia Ham a lot. But you see when I come up against that Mia Ham card? Yeah, it's so long. Like when I come up against that Mia Ham card, yeah, it's it's just such a long day, man. Like it's such a long day. Although, sour. Oh, no way. There was a little bit of lag. I feel like I'm going to get disconnected. Can you see the sign at the bottom? The EAFC sign is still there, and I don't know why. Why is that sign still there? Oh, a little boost. No? Okay. Oh, my days. He violated me, yeah. He tried it. He should have just shot first time. He tried the... um. That heel-to-heel -heel flick. I don't really see that very often. I know a lot of people say it's very sweaty. I don't see it. Now, one thing I have to say is, right now, um, yeah, it's just a bit crazy because I can't really... The game 
is lagging. And I don't know if that's coming across, but it is lagging. Like, it is a little bit slow. Oh, go on, roll for man. Oh, I love that roll for. Love that, man. Yeah, he's slow. It's definitely delayed. Like, I don't know if he's delayed as well. It looks like he might be delayed as well. But this game is horrendous, man. Like, it's actually so bad. Yeah, look at it. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Like, it's it's so bad. Yep, there you go. I knew it. I knew something was happening. I think it's because of the weather. The weather is so crazy out here right now. It's mad. I, I don't know what's going on. And I'm going to lose the game because of that as well. Amir, how are we doing? Carnage, what's going on? Fear, how are we doing? Welcome in, lads. Got Lasso is coming out, obviously, tomorrow. Um, I never saw a full list of the cards that were in packs. Obviously, I've never seen any of the cards anyways. But, um, yeah, man. So, it seems like the wind is going insane. God is vexed. Yeah, it's crazy. The higher above. That ain't right. Hey, Chich, how you doing, bro? What's going on, man? We're four and one now. Shouldn't be, but... Let me see if I can find the game. But right now, I think connection-wise, it might just be crazy. So I might just have to grind out. Yeah, look, it's, I'm, I'm, I'm finding it tough to even find the game right now. I'm not even going to risk any more games. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grind out packs and stuff ready for 6 p.m. Um, because, yeah, it does seem like it's a bit crazy at the moment. Uh, which is not a good sign, but there we go. What I'm going to try and do is I can try and get all of these done. Um, if I can try and get all of these done, then that's the main thing. But yeah, HH, how you doing as well? Big up. Right, daily bronze. One thing I have to say is, yeah, I'm so happy that we found like a no copyright sound playlist. Like, I actually love it. I love that we found that. It's incredible. Yo, Red Panda Gang, how you doing, bro? What's going on, man? I'm here to send you a message on Insta right now. See who I got. I'll have a look, bro. I'll have a look. Yeah, Carnage, appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. It's just chilled out. That's the kind of vibe I'm going for, man. Just a chilled out stream, you know? Nice. There we go. I mean, I guess I can open that up to be fair. I probably should be. I'm good, bro. I reckon I save packs for Friday. Do you know what? People have people have been asking that, and I don't know, you know, because it's it's a bit of a weird one because heroes and icons are in packs. It's a hero icon sort of promo, and notoriously, we know how hard those kind of cards are to pack. So I don't think so, you know. I'm I'm not gonna lie. Like I, I genuinely do not think so. I don't think it's worth it. But that, the only reason why I think that is because I know EA, EA, they're not going to make the cards easy to pack, you know? Dino, good evening, bro. How you doing, mate? Welcome in. Uh, so it's Galassa just Trophy Titans of this year. Pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. Now, what last year happened was they did actually release like baby sort of icons, like little bro versions. So that might help the pack luck. Like you might actually need to get stuff. But I don't know. Um, saving packs for Friday is not the move. Ain't no one packing heroes or icons. This is what I'm saying. My attack is sorted, man. Ian Wright, Winter Wildcard, Drogba from 84 times 5. Big dubs, bro. Fair play. Release Vinny. Yeah, see, Vinny is one that I'm looking for as well because I don't know if I'm doing Vinny. And I'm, he's going to be there for 30 days. So I'm just going to see, is this the is this the big next big SBC I'm doing? I did chew him any within a couple of days. And like, we spent like 200k on him. And then we got back with foot chance rewards and everything else. We got back about 100k. So we're still 100k down from last week. But regardless of that, you know, we're still grinding, I guess. Um, But yeah, it's going to be interesting, man. I don't know if we're going to... If Vinny's going to be worth it. I don't know. I have my rival rewards, etc. Yeah, I've got my rival rewards as well. Uh, rival rewards as well. I'm going to be opening everything today because I'm going to be doing the hero pick because I actually 
I've seen so like I don't understand yet. I've done a, I've done four of them. I've got bomb pasta. Who else did I get? Bomb pasta, food tray yesterday, and then there was one other card that I got, and it was trash. I think it was Viali. I think Viali, and I put him into an, another SBC. And this is gonna be the fourth one that I do. Like surely. Out of 12 options, 12 options, I surely have to get one dub. I've seen Marquisios, Bompastas, Tevez's, like even a Tevez. Like, give me a Tevez and I'll try him out, you know? I know he's not going to do anything crazy, but at least a Tevez, you know? If really won't come out for another few days, is it Leo still out for a few days, Dominic? Not necessarily, because they do sometimes link over. Uh, so not necessarily. I think everyone's expecting Vinny to come out tomorrow. I mean, we'll find out tomorrow in the afternoon, really. Touch should be after this dead promo. Might as well save your packs for during Galasso, Jamie. Very good point. Another very good point Jamie's raised. Because Tots last year came out after Trophy Titans. And we're at a similar time. It's going to be two weeks, right? So let's... So we're basically... I think what they're going to do is... I think two weeks tomorrow will work out to... The 12th of April. Now, I still think that's going to be one week early. So, I think for a whole week, they're going to do a team of the season prep sort of promo for, until the 19th. And I think the 19th is when team of the season starts. Now, if they don't do that, they could drop three Golasso promos. But I don't think they'll do that. They'll do two. But it's going to be interesting. It's going to be interesting what they do. Because there is a what there's a two week gap, but there's a, the, from the 12th to the 26th, there's a two week gap, where the 26th is more likely for it to be team of the season. So they still have a two week gap. So maybe they do a promo for a week, like a showdown promo week, and then they do a team of the season prep week. Maybe they do that. I'm not sure, but it's going to be interesting. My best was I've been 92 Tevez. He's great. This is what I'm saying. Like I, I've seen that Tevez quite a lot. Um, Barella is so cracked, Dominic Fez. Legend returns. Sop, my guy. Chris, how you doing, mate? What's going on, man? I am very good. How you been, mate? Uh, I've nearly finished my C Silver Evo. I'm doing some French lady. Fair enough. Uh, Leroy is still there for four days, but yeah, crossover. Played him up. Hoyland and Jota are out at the same time. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Um, I thought that would happen. So yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. But yeah, it's going to be interesting how they, how they do it because the Galasso promo will end on the 12th. And then from the 12th to the 26th, we have a two-week gap. So, I guess that's going to be the interesting thing to see what they feel. I'm assuming they are going to do a team, of the, a team of the season prep week. So, I think like a team of the season preparation, you know, they'll release like 83 times 10s and 82 pluses and like attacker packs, you know, upgrade, like specific position upgrades, all that. They'll release all of that. What I'm probably going to start doing is... I think from next week, the second week of the Galasso promo, I'm saving packs. Like I'm going to be grinding these League SBCs like there's no tomorrow. And I think I'm just going to grind out packs. And one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grind out and open. I'm not going to save everything for a Premier League and not opening during Community Tots. I'm going to be making just packs every day. We've got 1.6 million coins almost. We're probably going to get a lot more during team of the season. So I'm just going to grind every day. I have like, you know, 20, 30 packs every day that we rinse and repeat back into the exchange. More player pick. Every We're just going to grind because I made a mistake during team of the year. Yeah. And I, honestly, I was so dumb because I think the amount of packs that I had with the, especially with the exchange pack, I would have packed a team of the year in the, when the position only cards were out. When the full team came out, it all went pots, man. It all went pots. We both need to trim. Mine's expired. See, I'm actually getting a trim next week because my registry wedding is next Monday. So I'm officially married from next Monday. Like, legally, Fizzy is Mr. Fizzy. Like, that's crazy. That's kind of crazy. So I'm getting it next Saturday just so the trim doesn't expire on the day so I can actually get good pictures. Do you know what I mean? So I'm going to have to firm it for another week, but I can't lie. Chat. Yeah, it's looking crazy, man. Chat. Oh, my word. The trim is not trimming right now. Ricky knows what I mean by that, but the trim is not trimming at the moment. I can't lie. Busy chilling in his gown. Love it. Oh, mate, it's cold. It's cold. I don't know what's going on in the UK, but it's windy. It's rain. It's muddy. It's disgusting. I, I don't like it. It's like, I'm, I, I, I like, yeah, I just, I just feel warm. I love it. 
I feel warm. <sighs> but yeah. Uh, Chris, yeah, all good, bro. Flat out with workers, uh, working retail and flat out with football. Got two games in a week this week. Coming busy AF. Yeah, I feel you, man. I feel you, mate. I feel you. Nice. When do you have your wedding ceremony, Karin? So it's on the 8th of April. So not the Monday coming up. Monday following. Which is crazy when I think about it. Like, I'm actually getting married. Like, it's kind of mad. Appreciate it, Ricky. And big up, bro. I kind of feel scared, man. Guys, we've got only 30, over 30 people in this chat and we ain't even got 10 likes. Guys, come on, man. Team Boozer, we don't fall off like that, Timmy's. Smash that like the like button, man. We don't do that, man. Come on. Show your boy some love, man. Appreciate the business. Carnage, appreciate it. Thank you very much, mate. Thank you, thank you. All right, so I've, I've done all my daily upgrades. Uh, I don't think I've got anything else. Yeah, so the onk, so yeah. I, now, I don't know what, what I've got in this... Uh, Big up the Timmies, man. No, we do not big up Timmies. No, 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 no. Now, Auburn, I don't think can get another upgrade, so he can kind of go in. We got two versions of Hegerberg, also fodder. Pascaru is fodder. Schneider is kind of fodder, although I'd keep him just for a future Evo. Jonathan David is fodder as well. Um, we got Futra, who we got from yesterday's one. He's not fodder, but. Like he, I mean, he is basically min price. Like he's literally min price. Um, so at this point of the game, he might actually be fodder, you know, like, yeah, it's kind of crazy, man. Kind of crazy. Um, Tavernero is kind of fodder. We've got no 87, no 86 goals, no 85 gold. So we really need to get golds in the club. So that's why the 8320 will help out. And some of the rival rewards and stuff will help out as well. Hey, Rickin, let's go. Big up, bro. That's kind of mad. That's kind of mad. Red panning and where's my invitation? Sorry, to be honest, it's a um, it's a closed off ceremony. So we're only having our witnesses there. It's not one of them uh, ones that you get for like, do you know what I mean? So it's one of them closed off ceremony because we didn't really want to do much. Archie Gray. I think this guy is very good for Evos, isn't he? Archie Gray. Is he Archie? Is this Archie Gray? Yeah, Archie Gray. This guy's a baller. Apparently, like Leeds fans are saying this guy's gonna be the next guy up. He's a baller. 06 baby as well. That is crazy. So is he? 18. The kid is 18. But this kid apparently is very, very good. I might keep him, you know, because he's worth like a, a little bit, so he might be worth for Evo here. Ads, no worries, man. Fair preview pack. Good shout. There we go. Anything? Spanish? Left mid? You're not going to have one of them big Indian weddings, can't? Nah. I mean, we're, we're having our wedding in Mauritius, so it's not going to be a big wedding because obviously, if I was to have it here, then you get like that big Indian sort of vibe. But we're having the, um, we're having it as a destination wedding, so it's just going to be close family pretty much. I came to Europe after my wedding, man. Spent too much money, but I really like London and Paris. Fairs, man. Fairs. At least you enjoyed it, though. Being my missus 27 years, mate. You'll soon have no hair. Trust me. Oh, Dino, don't say that, mate. I'm so scared of losing... I'm so scared of losing what is on this head. It's crazy. Oh, mate. Oh, Amir, thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Uh, will Mrs. Fizzy like to play and grind the game or not after marriage? She will. She will understand. She knows it's part of the job, part of the hobby and lifestyle that we're trying to create. So I'm sure she'll be fine with it. Um, but yeah. I just got another campaign pack for free. Do you want to shit on separately with what? Why not? Yeah, fear. Why not, bro? Why not, bro? Let's go. Apparently, there was another update today as well, which is kind of strange. Like, there's another update going on. What's going on? Are EA changing the game? Again. Like, it's kind of mad. It is kind of mad. Kind of mad. I've got hiccups now as well. Great. Right. Do you know what I need to do? I need to hold my breath. Rip. Fear's going to show us a pack, yeah? I need to hold my breath because I've got hiccups now as well. 
Brown guys that got married in Kobe took a dub. Small 30 person wedding cheap. No invitation. Random family you wouldn't normally invite to if it's normal. Pocket saved that money. Ricky. Oi. You know, Ash was saying the same thing, bro. She was saying, we were literally talking about this the other day. We were saying, imagine if we got married in COVID. Like, do you know how crazy that would have been? Do you know how... The thing is that I feel like a lot of brown families would have made their kids wait and say, no, nah, why are you doing that? Wait till... Do you know what I mean? I feel like that would have happened, though. Anyway, with that being said, let me actually hold my breath. I was 20 seconds I can't in my head. Crazy. All right, that should be enough. Hopefully, I don't get hiccups from that. But yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. An update fact. What's going on? Bro, going to pass out before 6 p.m. I should have married during COVID, man. I was 17. Imagine. I regret not having a COVID, man. A uh, COVID wedding, man. Spent too much. Yeah. That's the thing, man. On a wedding, honestly, guys, like, seriously think about before getting married man I'm not saying that i have any regrets on it i'm just saying like it's a massive decision and it's not just a massive decision like emotionally and you know mentally and stuff and physically and stuff like that but financially it's a massive commitment like you're spending you we're talking 10 20 30 40 some people fifty thousand pounds like that's a lot of money man that is a ridiculous amount of money so yeah it's crazy out here man it is crazy. Don't know why I got my campaign pick. That's my fifth one. Oh, some people, apparently, if you open the foot chance rewards, I think it was like before Saturday or, or before Monday or something like that. Um, You got another one because apparently they were bugged out. I think that's what it was. They were kind of bugged out. That's, that's the thing. Right. With that being said, though. With that being said, you know what I should have done? I should have actually saved all of these uh cards to put back into the silver pack. But it is what it is. All right, there we go. 740 packs. Daz is ready for that team of the season grind, man. Bro, you're going to pack so many team of the seasons. I hope that you dash them all in exchanges just to grind out play. Bro, if I had the... Like, I want to get to... I want to try and get to about 100 to 150 packs, yeah? And I know that that's going to last me throughout the whole of team of the season as long as exchanges are there. If exchanges are not there, my coins will be going down. If not, then yeah. Get a fizzy pro club. I don't really play pro clubs a lot, man. I can't really... I, I've got so much, like... Or should I say, I've got so little time right now to dedicate anything else apart from what I'm doing right now. So it's, it's difficult, man. I get mad at, every, at getting a dupe every pack. It's already... Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I feel you. I do feel you, HH. But for me, I, I'd grind it out, man. I would grind it. Is that an inform? That is an inform, man. What a time to be alive. And I think I've already got this guy as well. I do, yeah. I do indeed. Oh, my. Oh, this one's tradable. Oh, what? Whoa, what a time to be alive. That is an instant 28,000 coins. I will take that happily, man. EA need to let us open packs with picks available. Picks and exchanges available. Absolutely. We should have exchanges when they set to refresh. When they're set to expire, they need to just refresh. Just refresh and have a 90 exchange as well. Why not? I might open some tomorrow if I can upgrade the team. Yeah, I feel you. Yeah, yeah. And then have the player picks available as well for that. 100%. They need to do it. If they don't, they're frauds. That's what they are. You know? But there we go. It is what it is. Right, we've got 20 packs anyways. We need to open all of these packs to um, get our... Uh, what's it called? Our 87, 387 squads done. That so we need fod we need we just need fodder from every pack. Like we need a walkout, maybe two, three walkouts every pack, but it's not gonna happen. The 83 times 20, I'm hoping for four or five walkouts at least, but you know, should be interesting. Oscar, how you doing, man? What's going on? JJ gameplay felt mudded for me after the update. Bro, I'm scared to eat. Anytime I see update from EA, yeah, I start panicking like a little girl. Like I start panicking. 
you know, I start getting a tingly feeling that's not right. It's crazy. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the JR Fizzy channel. Welcome to 6 p.m. content. We are back. All right, we're back for another day. If you haven't already, smash that like the like button. Hit the subscribe button for coming through. And let's see what we got. 6 p.m. business, baby. We are going to have a look at, obviously, all the Galasso promo stuff, which is coming out tomorrow. If you don't know, it is an Icon and Hero promo only, like Trophy Titans last year, where we had Icon versions and, um, uh, you know, Hero versions of said promo. So let's see what we got going on in the live section. We got Daily Play. Now, I have not played Daily Play. Uh, which is kind of crazy because I've actually missed out on a full day. So I need to do this one and I've still got four, uh, four days left. So yeah, I'll just about have enough to get everything back again. Uh, which is nice. Lee Gun anti-racism. We're there. Always, always, always. Um, champs bonus. Normal stuff. Weekly and daily objectives are back. I love that. More XP available. So I think we should be able to now get Western McKenney, uh, which is good uh milestones nothing new in milestones they haven't done that for a while which is I'm a, I'm a little bit annoyed about considering like they need to be doing that i don't really get why they've done nothing in milestones that's kind of crazy kind of dead but it is what it is legends of the pit jack of all trades secret stuff skilled wind defense one and two tricky radioactive dynamic precision and all that beautiful stuff that's all there i don't think we've got anything else anyway they're they're still the other ones and I always check my Evos every day. I still got to do Ben White. I want to get him in the in, in the team this week. But there we go. Uh, Red Panning Gang, take it easy, bro. Take it easy, man. Right, SBCs. Let's see what we got going on. New pick today. First of all, do not forget or you will regret. Let's get this one out of the way. Ultimate daily login. Now, I've already done most of my daily logins. But I'm pretty sure we get something for this. I think we get like an 81 plot double or something like that. 84 times 5. Refresh. We will be there. 87 i'm doing that today we're grinding this out today because yeah i need to get something good from that players it is uh leah williamson day where is she evan ferguson leah oh leah center back and cdm she's got anticipate plus and long ball pass plus i love it all right look at that High medium, four star, five star. Good passing. Reactions and composure are lovely. Physicals are good. Defending's good. Dribbling is not. Yeah, slap a shadow on this card. Slap an engine on this card. Oh, we will be there. She's an Arsenal women's player. I always. She's an Arsenal player, so we will be there. She's there for 13 days as well. Very easy SBC. 85 rated for that. I, I, I love that. We will be there. She's only 5'7", so she has to play CDM. She can't play centre-back. Um, well, she can play centre-back, but... I personally wouldn't do that, but there we go. Slap a shadow. 95... No. I think it's 93 acceleration, 93 sprint speed. Max out defending. Uh, physicals are very good as well. Um, yeah, listen. I, I love her, man. She, she, she's there. She is there. Anticipate plus as well. Uh, long ball pass is very good to switch the play, like... The amount of times you're switching plays, switching, switching. And she got the tech normal as well, which is kind of nice. So that's quite good. Um, so yeah, press proven, acrobatic, technical, jockey, block. She's got some nice stuff, man. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. Very nice card. She's very good. And she, the main thing is she can play CDM. If she couldn't play any other position, it'd be very difficult. But then you'd have to maybe switch her and Chuameni in game, her and Hullet in game, her and Vieira. Someone have to go center back while she plays in CDM, right? But nah, she will get completed. She'll be a favorite. I'll complete her. Not today, but I think she's a very, very good card. So I'm very happy about that. Upgrades, what do we get? So we get the 87 Encore Hero player pick, 84 times 5. Um, 82 plus, 83 player pick is back. Uh, I think that's about it. Yeah, everything else I've pretty much done. So this will get refreshed in 23 hours. So this will be, this will be back tomorrow. This will be back tomorrow. So that's very nice. Um, I like that. Okay. Okay, we're here for it. Um, there is a defender that has defending playstyles. Uh, Ahmed Zovic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know who you're talking about. I know exactly who you're talking about. Right, let's have a look at all the Golasso stuff. Because as I say, we have got new stuff going on. If we go, this is the new promo for tomorrow. Big up everyone in the chat, by the way. We've got over 100 people in the chat, which is the first time in ages. So smash that like the like button if you're new 
hit the subscribe button if you've never seen me before hello i don't always wear dressing gowns but it's cold man it is very cold right replies let's see what we've got going on uh post put perif top 10 strikers players we will never see in our entire lives ever we will never ever be there uh right I don't think there's many leaks. Oh, okay. There's loads of leaks. All right, here we go. Colette and Dempsey. So, we've got Colette. That is a sensational image, though. Like, that's a sensational image. I can't lie. That That's sexy, man. Like, that is a great dynamic. He looks very good as well. And he's actually... He, if they get his stats right... He's like a Nesta. If they get his stats right, he could be such a good card to use. Uh, and you got Dempsey, going to be very cheap, unfortunately. Clint, Clint is not the one. Uh, so there we go. It, it is what it is. Golasso, you know, fairs. They're the two heroes. Now they are coming. They're going to get big upgrades. We hope so. We do hope so. Oh wow! Oh wowie wowie! You will never, and I repeat, you will not see this card in your packs. But if you do, holy moly! Best right back in the game. I've still got normal version, the base version. This guy, oh my word. Steph, how you doing, mate? What's going on, bro? That dressing gown looks so warm. Where is it from? This is from Amazon, man. It's an am it's literally Amazon. I got it as a Christmas present. It's so good. It's so good, man. I, I, I love this dressing gown. Like, it's incredible. But Cafu, man. RIP Reese James. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone's the guy until the real guy steps in the club. Yeah. Cafu Golasso. Incredible card. We know that. Uh Francescoli. Again. I think this uh, I think when this guy when this guy's card came out, he actually had like a very nice card. Um so again, he's gonna be another one that I think they can really get right. That looks like a nice card. I mean, I think his stats need to be upgraded a little bit. I'm gonna go 92, 90, 92, 93 pace, 91 shooting is fine. 88, 89 passing, 94 dribbling, 80 physical, like, boost the stats up a little bit. Obviously, it is, we, we all know that he, the, these are uh, only predictions, they're not real. But yeah, end of era, Alessandrini, man. If you know, you know. Listen, if you played FIFA, FIFA 18, FIFA 19, was it FIFA 18? Yeah, FIFA 18, FIFA 19. If you know about Alessandrini, man, you're a real GOAT. I have his base card, it's actually good. Yeah, this is what I mean. You shouldn't be wearing a shirt under the dressing gown and make the most of the comfortability carnage. I feel you, bro. I do feel you, but I feel that's a little bit too crazy for stream, you know? Now, it says here, we shouldn't see normal cards in Golasso Provo, only icons and heroes. SBCs are going to be icons and heroes as well. Um, now, we have got... Uh, so, we have got uh, Berbatov, Johan, the king is back. And it's going to be Prinz. So the, the the German striker lady. She's got 90 pace as well, which is kind of mad. But um, Johan, man. Again, we will never see you, my son. Or my friend. The king. But we really hope so. But yeah, Cruyff is coming out. Berbatov is going to come out as well. And then Prinz as well, which looks very nice. Curla and Dempsey. Cafu, obviously, we know. Um, Enzo Fran Francescoli. As I say, if you know about the 86, if you know about those cards, man. Look at this. Look at this, man. This is this is crazy to me. This is what's coming out in this new promo. Supreme Golasso Pack includes 60 rare players. Rated 85 or higher only. 60 85 or higher cards. Like, what's going on, man? What is going on there, man? With one to be guaranteed 90 or higher. Also, three Golasso Hero or Icon Pick loans. It's kind of crazy, man. 85 times 60 is going to be... I, I don't know how much it's going to be. It's probably going to be like 60 pounds. 50, 50, 60 pounds for sure. Um... Now, as they say, it's going to be similar to the Trophy Titans. This was last year. Uh, so these are the cards that we got last year. Obviously, we had Ferdinand, Sen, Lucio, Torre, uh, Zidane, Burkamp. Like, we had a lot of good cards for this promo. Um, so it's going to be another, another one like that. And there we go. We should also see twin 
JJ Okocha cards. Now, I assume they'll probably be 5-4 uh, each way, like similar to Foot Birthday. Um, Okocha is one of them, which is crazy. It is crazy. Um, yeah, it's going to be very interesting, man. First million coin pack, probably. Yeah, capitalism, full flesh. Bro, it's crazy, man. Michael, Fizzy, my Twitter is full of porn. What can I do? Click the three dots, like these three, and just say... Uh, uh, I think, it, actually, if I go on the homepage, yeah, if I go on that, yeah, so it says not interested in this post. Click on that and it should filter out and make sure you don't interact with pornography. You know, don't do that to yourselves, please. Um, but yeah, just don't do that. So, wow, look at her. She's going to be very good, you know. I think she's going to be very good. I want to see who's better, Alawaran or Vinny. See, I, I agree with that, HH. I, I agree with that as well. That's a very good shout. Because if Alawairan is like 5-5, five, five, yeah, he's a must complete. He, you have to complete him. If Vinny's, if Vinny's going to be 5-4 regardless, Vinny's not going to be 5-5. Five, five. And with Vinny, the thing is with Vinny is, yeah, if you look at Vinny's cards like on the market, like if we look at Vinny, right? Let's have a look at Vinny. So Vinny's got his 89, which is still 100k. 123k for Vinny. That still shows to me that Vinny is still sick on this game. The fact that our gold card is over 100k in this market. Then you got nine, this 90 rated card, which is a million coins. Then you got this, this honorable mention with 1.5. And his Thunderstruck is 1.3. Now for me, obviously this one's got the two uh, playstyle pluses and he's a striker, right? But for me, I think Vinny's player of the month is going to be an either a 92 or a 91. I don't think it's going to be 93. That's just my personal opinion. So it's going to be very interesting. A 91 Vinny, yeah? realistically would you're looking on the market would probably be a 1.1 1.2 probably 1.2 million coins is probably what you're looking at but again with with the vinny like he, his shot power and composure are so low with vinny so i just don't know man i just don't know so there we go friends is set to come out as i say so she looks very good uh, and I think that's pretty much it, really. I'm not going to lie. I don't think there's much in terms... There are there are leaks that are coming out. There are leaks, but I just don't think there's as many um, in terms of leaks and stuff. Like, there are leaks coming out. Like, we had a few weeks where Foot Birthday wasn't really getting leaked out like that and all that kind of stuff. And uh, it was lovely. But, yeah, we are getting leaks back anyways. Uh, and there we go. Akotcha. Yeah, Akotcha coming as a Golasso player soon. I think he's not going to be an SBC. Yeah, there we go. So this is the one. Bobby Charlton, man. He's going to be insane. Mark, it's the myth, the legend, Fizzy. How are we doing, mate? What's going on, man? Welcome in. So Bobby Charlton is coming out as well. And this guy is going to be insane, man. Woo Sir Bobby. Now, again, you ain't ever going to pack this guy. But he looks very, very good from what I see there. Um, And this is, this is the one that we're waiting for. Now, this card... Could be a make or break SBC, man. I swear down. This could be a myth. Like, if this card, if they get this card right, yeah, and when I mean, like, it's going to be 96, 97 pace, 90 plus dribbling, high shooting. Like, if it's a 90 shooting card, it'll be disgusting. 5-5. Five, five. It's going to be, it has to be 5-5. Five, 5-5 five. Five, five at least. Well, 5-4 minimum. I think he's 4-4, four, four, right? Is Alawaran 5-4? I think he is. Or is he... No, he's 4-4. Four, four. I think Alawaran's 4-4, four, four, isn't he? Yeah, he's 4-4. Four, four. This card has to be 5-5. Five, five. Has to be, man. It has to be 5-5. Five, five. Right? Get him to 5-5. Five, five, and this card is going to be disgusting. It's going to be disgusting. So, yeah. Gennaro is also coming out as a Golasso player as well. So he's getting another upgrade on his triple threat card. Um, there's Alawairan as a hero. We all know that. Look at him. Oh, my word. Johan Cruyff is coming as a Golasso player. That's crazy. That's tomorrow as well, man. Golasso. Which is kind of mad. And I think that's all the leaks that we pretty much got, to be fair. But yeah, Croy, Alawairan, obviously Ginola, uh, Bobby Cholton. Like, it's crazy. But yeah, look at this. 
three playstyle pluses. That looks like that looks like Van Dyke to me. Is that Van Dyke? That looks like Van Dyke on a team of the season card, isn't it? Is this Van Dyke? Because that's a European card. I'm pretty sure that's Liverpool's third kit. A VAN. Anticipate. He's already got aerial, isn't it? It's the last promo before Tots. Yeah, it must be. It must be. It must be the last promo before team of the season then. So team of the season probably starting. Um, then team of the season probably starting on the 16th. Because if we have a look at the calendar. So this is going to be a two-week promo, yeah? So from tomorrow. So tomorrow is the 29th. So it'll be 29th to the 5th. That's for week number one. And then from the 5th to the 12th. So it'll end there. So I think we'll have one week of preparation. And then team of the season starts on the 19th. And we'll have community... Prem, League on Syria, Bundesliga, and La Liga, and then Ultimate for a week. Yeah, which takes us to July. So yeah, yeah. Team of the season, I'm thinking, are going to be starting. Uh, it's going to be starting on the 19th. Crazy. That's the prediction. Because I still think we'll have one week gap for like a team of the season prep sort of thing. I think. But that's crazy. That is crazy. That's VVD in it. Yeah, that's VVD, man. That's crazy. Crazy. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, let's open this uh, hero player pick, man. Let's get the cards to open this hero player pick. Let's open some packs. Let's see what we got going on. Big up to everyone in the chat, as always. Appreciate it. Let's get some fodder, man. I need some fodder. I need walkouts. I need everything right now. But yeah, anything that, that is a dupe, that will obviously go into a player pick as well. Don't worry about that. We will be there. A thousand coins, always welcome. But yeah, I think that is BBD. Fear, you're a fraud, man. Don't call it the dead Arsenal women's player. But yeah, Mark, today we got uh, Leah Will. Oh, I have to always see PSG there and you never know, innit? But yeah, we did get Leah Williamson uh, as the SBC. Uh, foot birthday, Leah Williamson. Is Aguilar, he is tradable, so no player pick for me. There we go. Bang. Cool. And we keep it moving. Right. Jumbo Premium Goal Pack. What we got? French. CDM. Savonier, man. Savonier. No, not Savonier. Okay. All right. All right. Another 15k. I need some walkouts at EA though. At least boards, man. Who the hell is that? I need 87s. Wait, wait Allegri's still man. Who does Allegri manage nowadays? Is he still in management or not? Nah? Am I bugging out? Is Allegri still in management? I don't think he is, is he? Right, 81 double. Come on, walkout. Brazil. Striker, that's not a walkout. That's going to be Gabby. Juve, I think. Wait, he still manages Juve. That's crazy. I didn't know that. 83 rated. That's going to be another 84 times 5 pack. Actually, no. Nah, do you know what? We're going to do a player pick. We're going to do a player pick. We'll do a player pick with, uh, with him. Because we've got loads of these anyways. Right, 80 plus player pick. Bang. Oh my days, 380 pluses. That is so crazy. That is so crazy. Yeah, I don't know. How are we going to get fodder to do this, man? How are we going to do this? Because I ain't even getting fodder from EA. Small prime. German. Cam. Wow. I don't know who that is. So, okay. I'm going to discard both because they both go for nothing, pretty much. Now, what have we got? So, we've got our 11 pack as well. We've got an 83 times 20. We've got three of these 11 packs and we got a 100 player pack as well. Let's open the gold players pack first. Get them out of the way. Um, I don't think we're going to get anything anyway. So, we'll just get them out of the way. We've got one dupe item. He's not tradable. So, we'll go into a player pick. And we will. This is how we're doing, man. We just need to see some. We need to see some. Um, some walkouts now. Three eighty-four. So twelve eighty-four pluses is gonna help. 
1584 pluses. That will help for sure. Um, it will definitely help. Any plans with the coins? Team of the season, bro. So we've got 1.5 to 1.6 million. Well, 1.6 million coins. And it's just going to be all grinded towards team of the season. So with the team of the season grind, I'm hoping that they do release exchange packs. So we'll just keep rinsing and repeating. Anytime we need to finish an SBC, like an icon SBC or a hero pick or a team of the season sort of SBC base, whatever it is. Yeah, just dash into there, man. That's the plan. That's what we've been doing. That's why the coins are just staying healthy right now. Hi, man. How you doing, mate? What's going on, man? What is going on? Buy the 85 times 60 with coins? Nah. Nah. Although, it probably would be worth it. It's probably a million coins. I mean, it's probably not worth it, but... Hamas, I do support Arsenal, mate. Yes. Yeah, we do. We do, mate. Right. What have we got? So, we've got... Okay, so we got these two. These two should give some good packs, hopefully. Come on, you legend. Let's go, man. Come on, you gunners, man. Oh, please be Sandra, please. Yes, love that. 87. Warhammer City. Hamas, I hope so, mate. I bloody hope so, man. I really hope so, man. We've got to take him at, at, at the Etihad this week. We have to. Like, if we re I really believe if we really want to get over a mental hurdle and go for that title, we have to beat City. Not draw, we have to beat them. It won't be crazy if we if we beat if we draw to City. It won't be like detrimental. Oh my god, Arsenal can't win the league. They bottled it. It won't be that. But I just think that that mental hurdle, yeah. You on PS? I am, bro. Yes. I packed 92 company out of the 87 plus pick, Darren. That is what we need to try and pack, Darren, mate. That is what we're going for today. Company would be the perfect player in my team. Perfect player. I need a center back. And he is top tier. That is 84 rated, I believe. It is indeed. One dupe, though. 83 Jimenez. Yeah, Hamas. No worries, mate. Yeah, this is the uh, share play if you want to send it through. Team Boozer. Right there. I love my boys to bits, but they're not made of the hard stuff. Not yet. I think losing to City will kill them mentally, Rickon. I completely agree. I completely agree. We lose to City. League done. I said this already. I know. I know this team. I would say we love our boys, man, but they ain't on it mentally, bro. They ain't on that. We know that. KDB Cook last year, best player in the Prem all time. Nah, don't do that, HH, man. He's not all time best player ever, bro. Nah, let's not do that, man. Nah, nah, nah. Sorry, that's Thierry Henry, one and only, forever. I don't care, man. Call it nostalgic. Call it whatever you want. It's not even Arsenal bias. People universally agree. There's levels, man. There's levels, bro, man. Lampard or KDB? See, for me, I'd say KDB. Hey, Hamas, no worries, bro. No worries, man. Send it through. I'll have a look. All right, low to high. Actually, let's not do that. Ronaldo clears on recharge part. Not in the Prem. In general, all time, yes. Not in the Prem. 84.5 is rubbish. Nah, man. You got to try. You got to believe. Not yet, bro, but I think they'll get there with more experience. We'll get there. Yeah, I, I know what you mean. KDB clears Lampard at even close. I wouldn't say he clears him. Let's put it like Lampard is the highest goal scoring midfielder in the Prem, right? I get a lot of penalties, blah, 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 but still a very good player. Let's not let's not do that. But I I, I, I do think KDB over Lampard. Personally. Right. Let's see what we're saying anyways. Now, we have got another Jumbo Premium, man. I swear I own a every 84 in the game. Always give me dupes. Yeah, I feel you. I feel you, man. I feel you. Come on, walk out. England, goalkeeper. That can't be a walkout. That is so crazy. Right, Matty Cash. Are you a dupe? You are, bro. That is into a player pick we go. KDB is the greatest Prem midfielder, Saj. How you think? KDB ain't the greatest. That's recency bias speaking. Who's the greatest midfielder? KDB is up there. Like, he's, he is up there. I do think with KDB, it is a bit of recency bias, but he is up there for sure. Although, people, the thing is, people will say recency bias, but then if, they, if you say, like, an old name, you'll say it's nostalgia. I don't know. 
KDB doesn't have the longevity of Gerald Skulls and Lamps. That, well, I mean, when did KDB join? He joined 2015, no? Like, yeah, I swear KDB, KDB's been doing this for like seven, eight years now. Although he's had a lot of injury problems, I have to say. If you actually look at his seasons, like he gets injured quite a lot. Ozil was better than KDB. Nah, don't do that. I love Mezu. He was my favorite player at Arsenal for so long. Parmas, uh, PSN is Team Boozer, bro. Team Boozer. So Team T E A M, and then Boozer B O O Z A H. KDB is too injury prone, but when he plays, he's incredible, better than Lampard and Gerrard. See, that's the thing. It depends what kind of combo you're having. If you're having a peak, then you could probably you could say KDB. Although I'd still say probably Gerrard, but. If you want to say peak, you can argue it. If you want to say longevity, you can argue that as well. So it depends. Irish, that was drunk. No. Today, Irish, we got uh, Leah Williamson. Uh, foot birthday, Leah Williamson as an SBC. And all the upgrades got refreshed, bro. Gerard ain't even in the discussion, bro. Zero prime titles. I ain't having it. Yeah, but then are we doing the player thing? Or are we doing players with the trophies, with the longevity? Like, what are we doing? Is that a mixture of everything? I don't know. Is do not disturb on? Um... Well, I'm showing us I'm showing us a pair offline. If that's what you're talking about. Hey! Speaking about Oi! Oi, Mike Theory! Oi, Mike Theory's a thing, man. Mike Theory's a thing. Mike Theory is a thing, man. Look at that. 83 times. Look at that. That's crazy. Ozil is a better football than Kevin naturally, agree. But Kevin plays in a super team where he can spam 400 crosses a game so he gets better assists. Also, slightly true. 85 times 10 uh, unlimited was so amazing. Yeah, it was, man. Those were the days. Right, I'll do another. I'll do. Check your noties. Yeah, yeah. Martinelli HM. I see you, bro. That's my guy. Yeah, yeah. KDB is going into that uh, the icon pick though for sure, or the hero pick, should I say? Can I edit command ads? You should be able to, yeah. You should be able to. That's like saying Cross is, uh, Cruz is the only good because he spams crosses at Madrid. Nah, but Cruz it, Cruz controls a game, man. Like, bro, did you see that pass for Germany? Like, oh my days. Harms, the thing is, I turn, uh, Harms, I turn it off completely just so that, because I don't really like getting notifications because it just spams during game and during streams and stuff. Another thing with KDB, you take KDB out of City, they don't really care. Take out any of Gerard Lamp's skulls out of their team, they crumble, goes to show the difference in quality. Um, uh, one thing I will say is that I think any Man City player will always have that argument against them because they play in such a great team. But we don't make that same sort of comparison to like, the Chelsea team, like Chelsea's team was incredible when you actually look at it. We don't even make that comparison to like, if you look at, we don't even make that comparison to like, uh, what's uh, Man United? Like Man United had a great team, man. But we don't say, oh, if you take skull, if you take skulls out, oh, hello. Is that Forsberg? Yeah, I'll take that. That's fodder. I'll take that. It's an interesting one for sure. It's an interesting one for sure. I think personally, I think if you take KDB out to City, I think there is I think there is an effect. In my personal opinion, if 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 City play without KDB on Sunday, massive difference. I think he does make a difference that way. Genuinely, I do. So I, I wouldn't agree with the whole, you know, oh, if you take KDB out, they're the same. I don't agree with that. Messi and Ronaldo always played in great teams, saying they play on a good team is a stupid argument. Well, this is what I'm saying, yeah. Biscuits is a brilliant midfielder too. Oh, Biscuits is one of the best, bro. One of the best. One of the best. And to be fair, I had a really poor take on 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 uh, Twitter once. Some guy posted a comp of uh, Sergio Biscuits, and I say, "Am I the only one who doesn't see him do any of this in game?" And I may have just not been watching him, but like, when I actually watch players, like you can see the kind of quality. Uh, take KDB out of the Arsenal fixtures last season. Gunners win the league. Shout, strong shout, strong shout. Got Pierce from eighty three plus. Palmas, fair play, mate. GGS. I like the originality of the team, bro. I like it, man. Kim Pembe, 
Bastoni, I wish I did. I like it, man. I like it a lot. Great team, bro. Hugo Sanchez as well. Okafor, Perez, Nico Williams. I like it, bro. GG's. Arsenal better. What a time to be alive. What a guy. What a guy. What a guy, man. What a guy. We love it. We love it. Send the reactions, man. Dubs. Biscuits and Casemiro are, are the two most underrated midfielders of the era. Casemiro, yes. Biscuits, I think, is rated. Like, I think Sergio Biscuits is very rated, man. I wouldn't say he's underrated. 83 times 3, what are we saying? Get out of here, man. He looks great when he gets clipped, but in-game, it's hard to see what he does. Sergio um, isn't getting goals. Yeah, that's what I feel. Biscuits isn't underrated. He's known to be one of the best DMs of all time. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Scholes is going. Even Neville said if you take Scholes out of that United team, they were nowhere near good. He controlled the whole game, Patrick. Well, this is what I mean. Like, it, it, because, like, like those kind of, like, those those sorts of players, like, their levels elevate the team around them. They're, they elevate the levels of the team around them. That's what I'm trying to say. Biscuits is overrated. Every time he was Barca, there was a better midfielder than him. Nah, don't do that, Carnage. Don't do that. That's nasty behavior. You can't say Biscuits is overrated. That is nasty behavior, man. Arsenal and Spurs fighting for zero European trophy spot. Gotta love it. Fair, you're a fraud. You know that. I hate you, bro. Why are you always hating on Arsenal, bro? Allow us, man. Allow us, bro. Now, because the other midfielders play a different role, he was always the dominated. Oh, he was domination. If you look at Biscuits, right, what he used to do for that Barca team. Pick it up. Pressure resistant. Couldn't get near him. Little Cruyff turn. Little dummy. Shimmy here and there. Little faint. You know, pass over the top. Like, it was different. Controlling, man. Controlling the midfield, man. Goals even retired and came out of retirement and played such an important winning role. And yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, Patrick, that's a very good point. Yeah. My guy went into retirement, came out of retirement, and then helped. Yeah, yeah, Fez, Fez, Fez. Right. Let's see what we got. 85 times 2 is 2 of them as well. Hopefully, we should get no dupes. Because, like I say, I've got nothing in the club in terms of gold cards. It is all opinions, Irish. I was drunk. I agree. I agree. Left wing, right hand, please be a double walkout. I need it. I needed a double there, man. I needed a double there. I support Madrid. I've watched Busquets more times than you can imagine. And you really don't rate him like that. I just find that crazy. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm bugging out. I don't know. I just find that crazy. No double in 285 times twos, man. That's horrendous. Diver and money to the ref every five minutes. No, I do agree with that. He did used to do a lot of that. I agree with that. Jude will be a goat midfielder. Jude will be very good for sure. We don't know how good he'll be. Let's see, man. Foot birthday. Let's go. Italian. Center back. Striker. Okay. Raspadori. No. Okay. It's going to be. Okay. All right. Double. Show me someone good, man. Someone that I ain't seen before. Who the hell is that? Oh, my days. I'll take it. Three walkouts, though. Exactly what I need. Whole of Spain dived. Yeah, I agree with that, too. Inform. Welsh. Cam. Who the hell is that? No walkout, though. That's crazy. Brooks. Okay, Harry Brooks. 85, so that is a poor pack. No dupes, though. Very nice. No dupes. Maybe I don't like him because I'm a Madrid supporter, but I don't know. I've never rated him. Very dishonest player. I think I think it's the Madrid thing there. Because I think I think it's the Madrid thing. And I think it is because you don't like the, the reaction and the stuff. I, I get it. I do get it. Don't get me wrong. I do get it. I don't like that kind of stuff either. I hear it. Um, But yeah. Biscuits, but a CDM in generation were any different. Played a massive role in Spain when the tournament allowed Barca attacking talent to do their thing. Also true. Very unselfish player in terms of what he did on the pitch compared to others. Isaiah, PSN, Team Boozer. Team Boozer, man. Xavi is my personal pick. Out of the three, I'd, for me, it was Iniesta. Out of the three, I'd say Iniesta. I think we can all agree Zidane is the GOAT midfielder. Yeah, for sure. That's, that's a good pick. Zizou is, yeah, different, man. Right, let's open the 100-player pack. I don't think I'll get anything out of this, but if I get a walkout, I'll be very happy. French, striker, imagine. Imagine if that was killing Mbappe, man. Imagine if that was Mbappe. We do get Griezmann, though, so I'm very happy about that. 
Hopefully, we get a couple 84s, 85s, which we do. 10 dupes, though. Yeah, 10 dupes. 84, 84 dupes and all that. Now, I think all the 84s and 83s we're going to put in. Now, the bronzes I'm going to get rid of straight away. Um, I, I, I just think it doesn't really matter about these bronzes. So, we got seven dupes, chat. These are the cards we have to remember. They'll go into a team of the week player pick. We're going to get rid of all of them in a team of the week player pick. Herbs is good from 80 plus player pick. Come on, GG's. Casemiro is the better CDM. Then Biscuits. No, 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 no. See, that's where that, that Madrid bias has to be coming in there. Surely, bro. You don't believe that. I don't. I, I believe you. Like, I hear it. I hear it. You hate Barca. You hate them, man. I hear it. I would never rate a Spurs player like that. I fully understand it. But come on, bro. You can't say that. Could be a hot take, but the rate Bellingham is going, I think he could end up being the goat midfielder. I don't know if it's a hot take, but... It's not a hot, hot, it's a hottish take, but it's not an outlandish take. An outlandish take would be, it's like me saying Saka's going to be the GOAT winger, like he's going to be better than Messi. That's an outlandish take. Bellingham is not outlandish, but again, Bellingham, the thing is, the thing is with being a GOAT player, I think there's a certain aesthetic to it as well. The reason why people rate Ronaldinho as highly as they rate him is not because Dino produced the best stats every single it's not because he won everything and it's the way he did it it's the way he, you know aesthetically he was very pleasing and i think that does come with the package zidane if you look at zidane aesthetics man the guy was doing this just disgusting he wasn't the quickest he wasn't the most agile but touch over the, that is he, the skill it's just it's crazy it's crazy it's crazy You know, I don't know. It's an interesting one, though. It's an interesting one, though. Yeah, I mean, they're all good. Yeah, they're all good. Like, we're talking about insane players. Yeah, I wish I was drunk. A lot of people say that, yeah. Galaxy, stop the waffle. Allow you, man. What do you mean, waffle, bro? You stop the waffle. How about that? Um, 83 rated. Now, I need an 85 here. I actually got rid of an... Uh, I shouldn't have got rid of an 85 card last. Because I got rid of an 85 card in an 82 rated squad. Yeah, Rickin, I hear that as well. I do hear that as well. Right, who's the dupes here? Because I feel like there is some dupes. I feel like one of these two are dupes. And there's like a 78 rated card or something. That could be a dupe. I don't know. Bruno Fernandez is not that guy. Is that 83? That's not 83. That's 80. Oh, wow. Okay. We're very far off here. Speaking about biscuits, there he is. Ah, uh, 83. You're telling me people would wa rather watch Bruno than Odegaard? Well, this is what I'm saying. Like, all these, all these crazy, man. Right, this Alex Romero and this Numa, they're going to have to go into a player pick, man. Yeah, Bruno ain't great on the eye. Irish, all the best, mate. As always, love you, mate. Have a good one. Have a good one. Who's the other dude, man? I keep forgetting. Who is it? It's, um... Oh, this Tuma guy, that's it. Eighty five rated in a player pick, love that. And we get Doku in this one as well. Look at that. There we go. All of a sudden, Palmer is better than Saka. I'm tired of football fans, man. Yeah, I hear you, man. I do hear you. It's a long day, man. It's a long day. All right, let's see what we got. So we got an eight, one more 84 times five. And then we're ending it off an 83 times 20, where I'm then going to try and grind out this player pick and see what we get from it. 
I'll take that though. Another 28k right there. Not even 28, another 29 and a half K. Bruno's got to be the most overhead player over the last five years. He's been top five Prem since his debut. People seem to forget he outscored and assisted Lampard best season twice. This is what I mean, the patch. But I think it, the thing is, I think for a lot of fans with Bruno, I think aesthetically he just doesn't hit. That's the thing. I think for, for some football fans, aesthetics matter a lot. To me, I'm one of them. I can't lie. I am one of them. But then on the other hand, sometimes I rate players when aesthetically they're not all that. So, I don't know. It's difficult. It's difficult. German, striker, please be double. Bro, 84 times 5 has been jarring, man. They've not been great. And we get the same inform again. I do need an inform. So, they are going to have to go in. But... Right. Let's see what we got anyways. Encore hat. Encore. What can we get rid of? So... You are going to go. I'm keeping the Hegerbergs just because I'll need him for that big SBC. Um, I need two. I need a couple 87s in her as well. So we're going to put two 87s in there. And I'll put all three of these, all five of these in the next one. And then we need like an 86 rated squad for the next one, don't we? This should be okay, actually, because 91 KDB, that's a high rating. Like 91 and then 87 rated squad, that should be quite high. So we should actually be okay here. Okay, so we're actually quite overkill here, I feel. Okay. Have a look. Okay, we're at just the limit, all right. The thing is, yeah, like I said, again, with Bruno, it's it's the aesthetic. It's He doesn't do what a typical midfielder you expect from a typical midfielder. He's, he's, he's an effective player, which is he will get you the goals and assists. But I think over a long period of time, will that transpire to a pattern of play? Will that transpire to, you know, something like how an Odegaard does where he controls the game? I don't think it does with Bruno. Yeah, Patrick, but I th yeah, I, I do know what you mean because I, I remember when Bruno came into the league, he was actually a good midfielder. I just think that this whole hoofing and losing the ball thing, it's really hurting him. It's really hurting his rep as well. 83 times 20. I didn't, I got what, I, I didn't get a single walkout yesterday, but we do get one. We, do, we get a double walkout. Now, this could have an icon. Talking about a star boy, what a time to be alive. Um... Who's that? Rodri. Okay, look at that. Nice, nice, nice. 89 Rodri. I like that. Now, you can still get icons at the end of this, I think. I think they just don't show up. Nope, nothing. Crazy. All right, here we go. So, we need to get rid of all these 83s. Now, mo what I'd probably plan to do is put them into a team of the week player pick. But there we go. Um, But for the save, you don't see me do this often. But we are going to try and get the player pick done as soon as possible. I don't usually advocate to do stuff like that but yeah um isaiah yeah send it through bro if you send it through i'll open it quickly thing is he doesn't play like that for portugal because they have players who can play with the ball united are all about fast counter attacks high pressing now none of them can carry the ball yeah i feel you i i do i get a sense of what you're saying i think united style definitely isn't suited for the the controlling sort of tempo vibe 100 percent. i agree with you there um, but again, I think that stems from the manager. I think the fact that the manager doesn't feel he can play that. I, like for me, right? I've always said with Eric Ten Hag, I think Eric Ten Hag is a manager. I think like people, people always say, oh, he played a certain way at Ajax. Yeah, but 
It's Ajax. Everyone plays that way at Ajax. I don't think that was Ten Hag style. I think that's been drilled in at Ajax. Not from Ten Hag. I think that was a thing that Ajax have always set out. But, but, I find it hilarious. If you want to play a certain style of football, you have to, yes, adapt to a certain point with the players you have, but not completely. Like, you do not see Man United playing a controlling level of football. Like, it's it's just, I don't know what I'm seeing from United every week. I don't know what's going on. Is Team of the Year Ribery worth? Not at this stage of the game. Normally, I would say yes, not at this stage of the game. We have to start talking about R9 if the mic theory is in full effect right now, Oscar. R9? R9 is there, man. Very true. Very true. Eighty seven works, eighty six works. I think eighty five doesn't, doesn't it? Oh, eighty five works as well. Okay, we can get an eighty five rate card in. Slap Jack Grealish in there then. Eighty five is four thousand coins. Oh my word, bro! This market is dead, man. Wait for Vinny I'll ride around before you start Ribbery. Yep. Yep. Nick, great shot from ads there as well. Defo, wait for that. Prime Electrum, did we get anything in there? USA, centre back. Is that 80? I'll take an 85. I will definitely take an 85. That goes into the club. Ben Cheds will be quick sold for now. All right, 86 rated, man. Chat, I've been defeated by these hero picks, man. Uh, these hero picks have defeated me, man. I'll be honest. I'm surprised Timo hasn't got an upgrade yet. Is Timo due another upgrade? Or has he got all of his upgrades? I need a high rated special card in here, though. I'm so tempted to put Futra into this right now. I can't lie. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this Savonier into it. Hey, Chase, bro. We don't really need any more mods at the moment. Because, you know, what I mean, obviously, like, the views aren't really crazy up like that. So it's, it's one of them ones where mods are only really needed, I'd say, if, like, the chat's going crazy and nuts, you know? Right. Oh, 87 doesn't work. Wow, okay. Endler. Okay, so I need an 88 rate card. That's kind of mad, but fair. Also, already the Ribery, 12 goals, 7 assists in 5 games, all in Div 1 Elite. Nah, listen. He's a great card, but 88s are 15k. Oh my. Bro, this market is on the floor, man. It's on his ass right now. That is crazy. 88s are 14k. These SPCs aren't even costing you loads, man. I say you try your luck at these big packs, man. Because the fact that the SPCs aren't even costing you like that is kind of crazy. Anyways, with that being said, though, smash a like on the stream, hit the subscribe button, and I'll chat. I'll, I'll see you on the next one. But we will obviously finally do our last stat reveal for this week. Because, as I say, guys, I won't be live tomorrow, unfortunately, for the new promo. I know it sucks, but I have to sort out a few things in the new house um and then also uh sort out stuff for the wedding uh clothes and stuff like that as well so we've got more of that stuff going on uh for the registry wedding next week so yeah it's going to be interesting man it's going to be an interesting couple of months i can't wait till it's kind of all over so i can kind of get back to the grind get back to normal life and stuff and yeah have it all just be done but with that being said big up to everyone coming through as always let's see what we got man this this it's gonna shock me 88 physical that's a good start 91 defending so that's a defender 82 dribbling okay all right okay 82 passing 58 shooting 82 pace oh i thought it was gonna be someone good man his stats look very good i may be bugging out but his stats actually look very good preferred cdm center back medium high four three He's rubbish, is he? 
He's got intercept, long ball. Tough times, man. 74k. That is peak. 91 physical. Wow. Eighty-nine dribbling with ninety-one physical. Who the hell is that? Eighty-three passing, ninety-one shot, eighty-eight pace. Okay, Carlos Tevez. All right, UCL Carlos Tevez. Okay, I mean it's a UCL card. It's not the um, not his fancy card, but he is five-five. I think on this, isn't he? No, he's five-four on this one. Okay, all right, Fez, Fez. Fez, Fez, last one. 83 physical, 87 defending. Yeah, this one's a UCL card for sure. You can just tell by his level of stats. Yeah, Scott. Okay, well, we do get a fancy card. I mean, I don't even really know who to take here. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Like, who do I even take here? How many hero packs have you opened? We've opened all four of them. We've opened every single one. And we've got the best player is Paolo Futre and then this guy, Tevez. I think the cards that we've got, we've got normal bump, UCL bump pasta. I think Oli Gunnar Solskjaer or Viali was the other one. Tevez in this one. And then yesterday we got Futre. Is it Tevez? Is it Tevez? If you don't use Tevez, go Mascherano. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure Tevez is probably the most value, right? Yeah, he's 350k. Oh, he doesn't sell. He's at min price. Oh, okay. That uh, makes sense, yeah. I'd probably go Tevez. Probably just. I'd probably just go Tevez. Um, Because, yeah. I don't... Yeah. I'd probably just go Tevez. Mike says Mascherano. I opened one and got Yaya. Bro. I got fancy Marquise on UCL company the two I have done. This is what I'm saying. I keep seeing people get so many good things in this. And I can't get a single damn thing. It's so annoying. Like, this guy's 95k. But is this guy good? I don't know, man. Because I don't really care about Tevez like that. Personally, to take him. But if, if, if Mascherano is not great. Like, with his stats, he looks quite good as a CDM. <laughs> it's IRC then, bro. So, wait. I don't get it. Do we take Tevez then? I don't really... Oh, it doesn't even matter, man. Who cares? They're both, they're both dead. They're not really gonna... Yeah. Listen. Guys, thank you so much for watching this stream. Big up to everyone coming through as always. If you haven't already, smash that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you're new. And I'll catch you in the next one, man. We will be back for another day. I've been your boy. And I hope you enjoyed. Team Boozer. We out. Peace.